for the acorn and we're at the limewire studios in new york city and the song is called cobbled from dust They are awesome enough to be stopping by the Lime Wire HQ today. Your last day in New York? It is. Um, yes, they. I know, so sad, but awesome. I know, don't cry. Good thing you have the glasses on. Um, uh, yeah, they have a new album out called No Ghost. And uh, I guess you're just beginning? Are you just beginning tour? We're just starting to tour for the record now. Uh, it came out in Canada June 1st, so we, we we're playing a lot of festivals this summer in Canada, and then we're going to be touring pretty hardcore in the fall. Excellent. Where do you go after after your home country? Uh, we're going to play, we're going to do a whole like North American tour in, the, in uh, September, October, and then we're going to go back to Europe uh, in uh, November, do Scandinavia, France, all that stuff. That's great. Um, tell me about the new record. Is it a, a departure for you guys at all? Is it another step along the step along the Acorn path? Uh, yeah, I think uh, probably a, a another forward step in the Acorn trajectory of mystery and excitement and wonder. Um, it's uh, yeah, it was a record we we decided to write at a cottage um, after we'd spent about two years on the road, and uh, we just wanted to uh, spend some time together as a group and write as a group for the first time in a while because we all live in different cities. So, um, so it made for really uh, an interesting writing experience, and we had this beautiful private lake uh, along with the cottage. So it was it was a, it was a really relaxed way to write, and yeah, a lot of fun. Yeah, that makes the process a little easier, I'm sure. <laughs> first time kind of writing en masse like all together in one room that was a new a new thing for you guys uh, a little bit back in the day when we used to live in the same city we might jam stuff out every once in a while but that doesn't happen these days yeah. so you're spread out throughout Canada like all the way across well no 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 um, um, Jeff and Steve are in Toronto uh, which is about four and a half hours from Ottawa and uh, west and then uh, east two hours is uh, Jeffrey in Montreal yeah, okay. yeah. Well, between the three of those cities, I feel like you've got quite a scene out there. 
Um, to support you, or no? Yeah. How do you feel about yeah. the Canadian music situation? Oh, uh, the Canadian music scene is amazing. Uh, we have a lot of friends across the country. Uh, I mean, before we came into the States and Europe, we, we toured Canada quite a bit. So um, we, starting in maybe 2005, we started making sort of connections across the country and meeting friends. And um, so there's, a, there's, I think we're part of a maybe a pocket of friends uh, all over the country that kind of are scattered all over the the landmass that uh, you know we support each other we book shows for each other we have house shows together we uh, uh, we watch every band sort of you know grow and 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 progress so um, yeah there's a really supportive network of bands in Canada it's, it's a real there there is a real sort of community feeling in the country I feel uh, as a whole <laughs> just touring the new album are you guys do you do you write as you tour does that happen or do you kind of I don't know just relax on your in the van when you have the time Jeff, Jeff writes on the road Jeff's do always, I yeah. do you I don't but uh, I almost did once <laughs> you thought about it yeah okay. I, I there was like the small inkling that I might do it and then I didn't but um, and Ralph definitely doesn't write on the road it was one of the reasons we had such a kind of a long time in between records. I mean, the first one came out in September 2007. Not first, the last one, I should say. Um, and then uh, it's 2010 now, so three years. And we did a lot of touring on that. And I think that's part of what, what held it up a little bit is that um, we didn't have a lot of time to write. Yeah, well, it's hard to focus when you're in a million places at once. Yes. Yeah, for sure. Um, well, we wish you the best on uh, your uh, the, the Canadian tour and then many other countries beyond that. And uh, yes, thanks for being here. I'm going to say goodbye to you guys before we all melt away on this hot New York day. Thanks. Thanks. <laughs>